everybody welcome back to my channel it is my birthday i'm super excited to be here on my birthday recording this video because it's been a while today i just wanted to walk you guys through how i blow dry my hair and i want to introduce you guys to this tool this is the panasonic hair styler ehka 71-W so this is the product name and number I guess so my father got this for me way back in 2012 in his friend's beauty paid shop I I told my dad that you know my hair is like you know it keeps staying wet deep down inside you know like closer to my head because my hair is like super thick and it kind of you know stays wet inside and I feel like it gives me migraines and my father was like okay fine i'm gonna get you something i kind of wanted it was again a birthday gift back in 2012 so i was super excited to actually get my hand on this tool they showed me a few curlers and hairstylers but i was too young to understand how to use it and i was just excited to get my hand on something like this right so when they actually showed me this tool which can actually curl and it can straighten your hair it can also you know dry your hair you can use it as a blow dryer i was super excited and i I immediately just opted for this so I it's a very old tool you guys and ever since I got it though I've been meaning to make a YouTube video about it but can you guys believe since 2012 and now it's 2022 like how long has it been nine years ten years you know and I never got around to actually making a video <laughs> like and now I see all these girls with uh, the Dyson air wrap and all and then I start thinking that I have something that works with hot air, with styles hair. So I just wanted to introduce this tool to you guys. And I and this is the tool that I kind of use to like blow dry my hair completely. My hair is actually semi wet right now. If you guys can actually see it's still wet. And I use it to just blow dry my hair and sometimes even straighten it. So just look at the texture of my hair right now this is how it is it's been air drying so i'll just like blow dry it out and i'm going to show you the different heads that i use to actually achieve a proper blow dry in my day-to-day -day life so these are the different types of heads that you get with uh, the panasonic hair styler this is the st styler head that you use to kind of blow dry your hair and this is the hair curler I've rarely used this because I just felt like my hair just flew away when I was trying to use this. So this is completely made out of steel and you use this for curling your hair. You use this to add some sort of volume in your hair like you know in the roots to add volume. And this is amazing. My hair though it naturally kind of you know it stands really well if you guys can actually see it stands really well. And when it's super dirty my hair tends to have that beautiful bounce but this tool is amazing you guys see it's got it's got these air vents right so it blows this hot, hot air and it really just styles your hair very very beautifully especially when you want that front poof sort of a thing it's amazing and uh, this is the one that you use to add sort of curls to the edges of your hair this is nice again something that i've rarely used because i didn't know how to use it back then and finally this is something that i use the most common thing that I use, so I use this to like straighten my hair and also give it a beautiful, beautiful blow dry sort of shine. So this is the head that I use for that. So you guys, this is the body of the Panasonic hair styler. It's got three levels, one, two, three written over here. And you can, this is one. Number one is actually the cool setting. Number two is the, you know, sort of hair styling and setting uh, level. And number three is the blow dry setting level. So I kind of just put it in the blow dry. I don't use the blow dry tool to actually dry my hair. I just put it on blow dry and I'll get to the roots where I don't want my hair to be wet or, you know, because of the headaches and stuff, I don't want it to be wet. So I literally just go to the roots. So I'm going to do that quickly for you guys.
So now after blow drying in really warm air, I kind of put it in number one, like the level one in cool air and I kind of just cool my head off because I feel like it gets super hot. We are done blow drying in like the warm setting and the cool setting. This is just how my hair looks, you guys. Can you see it's it does not have a lot of you know it's, this is how my hair is naturally. I if I kind of want to go for like a really nice straightened look, what I do is I take my hair styler and I put on the straight uh the straightening head. You just have to clamp it over here like this. Watch it clamp and ta-da your straightener is ready so now what i do is i put it in level number two and i start straightening my hair can you guys like see the difference so this is the hair that i kind of straightened using the straightener head and this is a smooth it's not like pin straight like you get with a straightener right but it's sort of like that beautiful blow dry straightened hair and it's smooth it's silky and as you guys can see it is super shiny so this is how my hair otherwise normally would be like this is a wavy and it is but when you use the straightener head this is how it looks so what i do is when i straighten i take a bunch of my hair i go straight down like this and then what i do is i turn the head and then i go like this so with the tension right with the tension and pull it kind of becomes super straight and really nice shine you get from the blow dry so i'm going to do that for my whole head in fast forward and come back to you guys with the end result So that's how my hair looks when it's completely straightened using the straightener setting I mean the head on the Panasonic styler and this is how silky smooth and shiny it looks so now what I do is I quickly just put it on the cool setting and I just run it around my head to set everything in place this is the final result this is how silky smooth and shiny my hair looks after using the panasonic hair styler so this is how i blow dry my hair now that my hair is like silky straight and without any knots what i like to do is i like to use a hair serum so i use a hair serum afterwards and also if i'm doing any sort of hairstyle right so if i'm kind of going to curl my hair or if i'm going to do spring tight curls i love to just blow dry my hair first because it just prepares my hair so well for any sort of other hair styling i kind of like doing this with my hair look at that look at that so much hair and that's the reason i love uh, you know using a blow dryer because my hair stays wet throughout the day if i don't blow dry my hair that's how much hair i've got right so i absolutely adore using the panasonic hair styler it completely gives me you know beautiful sort of really nice hair that i can just play with afterwards you know i can just curl it i can do whatever i want for my birthday i can put on any hairstyle and it's just so well prepared so this is how i blow dry my hair if you guys found this useful please give it a like and also i don't know if this tool is still available in the market so if you guys happen to buy this tool please let me know what you guys think about it and all of that and if you have any questions please write down in the comments even if i'm not answering there are a bunch of other people who actually you know buy the product use the product i find a sense of community you know in the comments like people are helping each other out and that's just amazing so this is just my bare skin you guys i'm yet to do my birthday makeup which i will in some time 
but this is just the beginning of my birthday hair so i'll see you guys in my next video do stay connected and stay safe bye